hi guys welcome back to prospect channel tv thank you for this coming out here may god bless you all pa ayor adebanjo the leader of the pan yoruba social cultural organization afina Fere has berated some igbo some people from the southeast region of nigeria for allegedly not giving financial support to the presidential candidate of the labor party peter obi in the forthcoming election and these have got Nigerians talking. He said many Igbo people are billionaires, but not giving Peter will be financial support. Ayo Adebajo queried. Adebajo adopted Obi as his preferred presidential candidate in 2022 and has maintained that he remains the best candidate. Adebajo, Adebajo the leader of the pan yoruba social cultural organization afina fere has berated some people from the southeast region of nigeria for allegedly not giving financial support to the presidential candidate of the labor party peter obi in the forthcoming election adebajo adopted obi as his preferred presidential candidate in 2022 and has maintained that Obi remains the best candidate. According to Adebajo, apart from being competent, Obi should be elected the next president of Nigeria for the sake of equity and fairness and to ensure a, unit, a united Nigeria. While speaking at an event organized for the late president's general of organizing Digbo worldwide, Professor George Obiozo in Lagos, on Wednesday, Adebajo lamented that some wealthy people from the southeast Nigeria, Igbo, are not giving Obi the financial support required to drive his presidential ambition. He said that while many Igbo people are billionaires, they have refused to support Obi's presidential bid financially. The Afina Fere leader said these days, I don't fancy those who talk about United Nigeria in peace without action to back it up. Many people, even among the Igbo, pay lip service to a United Nigeria because of their selfish interest. Obiozo was not one of them. Obiozo was a distinguished scholar and ambassador per excellence an intellectual of international repute and a qualified and distinguished Nigerian. When you want to mention the people who gave this country recognition and respect, how can you not mention George? He asked. He's one of our pride. He should not have gone now because we are in the middle of a great battle. Unfortunately, the Igbo are not giving Obi financial support. I am challenging you openly. You have not been giving Obi the financial support. Those of us supporting him are poor people. I know that you people are billionaires. This is the time to spend your money for a good cause. Obi must not suffer anything financially in this cause when he has you people it is a great shame and that and that is one of the reason i am missing obiozo a man of courage a man who we call a spade a spade very diplomatic courageous and distinguished in character i hope there are more of him in igbo land who will contribute to the struggle to keep nigeria a united country in peace Meanwhile, Nigerians have this to say. Hmm. Well, those who do not want Peter Obi to be the next president of Nigeria, they are happy not supporting him anyway. Peter Obi do not need their support because it is curse. The good thing about this is that Peter Obi will win election even without them. We, the Igbo masses, we give Peter Obi our full support by casting our votes for him. 
those Igbo billionaires will be shocked at what will happen after the election. Those of you that trust INEC and the electoral process in Nigeria will be disappointed. Though. Forget the shambolic fraud called election. Those in possession of power are very powerful, corrupt politicians that you cannot take away power from with ordinary PVC. These people control INEC. Mm -hmm. But at least let us vote. Let your vote be counted first. It's important you vote. You cannot just say people are there, you know, to sabotage the effort. When you did not vote, go with your PVC and vote and see how they will play the game. Because Nigerians will vote and stand by their, you know, by, by, by the, by the uh, 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 ballot box and see what they are going to do with it. This time around is not, is not uh, uh, what is it called? It's not joke. Nigerians are really serious for this. You understand? And anybody who wants to dead them, you, you, sorry will be your name. I neg there do nothing concerning this election because if they do that, hmm, maybe they are the one that want to, they want to break up Nigeria. What we are just begging this Nigerian government, please, let this election be free and fair. Even though those who do not want to spend their money and whatever to support Peter B, that is their own business. You understand? That is their own business. Let this election be free and fair. Those structures they are talking about are, are, are now Nigerians. They are Nigerians because they will say Peter V will not win because he does not have a structure. But Nigerians are the structure. And these structures, they are ready to cast their votes. And that is why they should allow this election to be free and fair. You understand? So guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Mm -hmm.